you want to know how you know you've had a good night out? <laughs> you sleep up with a full face of makeup. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to the channel. Suti here. I can't shout because I've been <laughs> had a good time last night. Kind of celebrating my husband's kind of just hanging out with friends. And uh, yeah, the kids are away. So this vlog is about what I would do or what I do, what I'm going to do without having kids around. So when I have a kid free weekend, what I get up to. Ordinarily, you would think I'll be resting, but I'm not resting today because I have a lot of things to do. First of all, my sheets are stained with my face. My face planted on my sheets. I need to do laundry. Um, I need to cook a little bit. My husband is traveling, so help him pack. I need to arrange my wardrobe because um, I need to give out some clothes. I like to frequently you know check my wardrobe to see if there are clothes that i'm not wearing again and that people can be used that can be useful to other people i really don't like clutter and i can get my my life can get cluttered really quickly i also have to go take my kids for piano lessons so right now it's past eight almost nine so i have to do a lot if i go pick them from my mom's house take them to piano lessons come back and finish what i have to do and then go back and pick them up and then yeah continue with the weekend so i hope you enjoyed this vlog let me go wash up my face and take off the night okay and i'll see you later so i typically put my micellar water on my um wipes and then clean off the initial makeup before i start washing my face so um when i sleep off with makeup like this So this is what I'm going to use on my face. Because I wear a full face, you can still see there's a bit of makeup. Yeah, but that was mostly for my eyes because I didn't really clean my eyes well. So um, this product is three in one. It's a face scrub. It's a wash and it's also a mask. So I'll put it on my face again and leave it to sit for 15 minutes while I do other things. That's literally what I do. I have another face mask, like a charcoal one, but I really want this one because it's that time of the month and I have been breaking out. You guys can see there's one random people on my eye, on my lip, and this just really gets in there. And because of the tea tree and everything, it really gets in there. I don't leave it out for long though. I just. Um, Just leave it for 10 15 minutes and then I wash it up and I'm good to go. Okay, so that's basically it. My face of the sheets. size of a pack of windows has reduced the quantity or the cost has increased this was inside a pack of windows right now oh shit
I mistakenly put the thing here inside. Week. A lot of you said, Oh, keep it, keep it. Um, it looks so nice on you, but you guys don't know my mom. <laughs> uh, there was one time I was going out with Adesi, and um, Adesi and Nedo, I think, and I was in my parents' house. I didn't plan to go out, so I didn't have a week, so I just bought the week for her. So, guys, let me tell you that after I bought the week, I decided to not dye it for her, and then it delayed because the guy that um, does my wig, whatever, left his saloon and moved to another saloon and blah 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 blah. Every single day, I'm always coming, where's my wig? Where's my wig? Where's my wig? There's no hat she will let this wig go, okay? It's her daily, everyday wig. So I package it and I'm returning it to her. I'm off to go pick the girls. I've done laundry. Um, yes, I've done laundry. I have cooked for my husband, I've just made noodles because he's traveling, like I said. I've started arranging my wardrobe, but when I come back, I'll finish. And so I'll see you guys later. This is literally, I'm supposed to be kid free, resting, watching One Tree Hill because I started One Tree Hill, but almost I have a lot of things to do back and forth, back and forth. So I'll see you guys like when I come back with the kids, I'm arranging the wardrobe, I'll show you what I'm giving away, what I'm keeping, and all of that good stuff, okay? Mwah. Bye. hey guys happy sunday welcome back to the vlog so everything that i thought i was going to do in this vlog i couldn't do it why because my kids decided that they want to spend time with their mother i took them for piano lessons music lessons and after that we went back to my mom's place for them to eat and then i was supposed to just go back home come back and do my you know fold my clothes um select the clothes i was going to give away even go to the market try to cook for the week all the things i planned zilch nothing the kids were like they want to go with mommy they want to go with mommy they want ice cream they want this so i just briefly visited my grandmother they saw their great grandmother spent time with her and then they came home and that's it for my plans and nobody really talks about this or maybe people talk about it but i don't know how much how like annoying it can be annoying it can be you know to be involved in your kids life surely when you're in this kind of part of the world where you have help and you have a lot of access to resources for very cheap 
okay nobody talks about the fact that sometimes you don't get breathing space literally my kids follow me everywhere right now i had to lock my door to even film this jasmine is like mommy 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 come and do this for me mommy mommy, mommy come and be with me for this mommy, 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 mommy. like even in church like they would not if they that i'm teaching teaching ch children from the school the day i'm teaching children's class hmm like I, I have to sneak in so that they don't know that i'm there so that i can effectively teach the class the other class like the older class because if they see me next thing they're not going to be in their class anymore i don't know if it's only me that experiences this probably not but on um, my children like the gun body is, is too much sometimes i'm not complaining you know i kind of am but i'm not i don't know if you get what i mean i'm not but yeah um yeah sometimes you can get super overwhelming parenting um not having breathing space not being able to do what you want at your own time and feeling guilty about it because like when i lock my door now now i'm feeling guilty that okay is the help that i stay with them or they're watching tv and stuff like that oh i should be doing more i should be doing better you know even though people are watching me and saying oh thank you for doing more thank you for showing us that you are doing more it's inspiring i mean i'm like i'm not doing enough i need to do because the other people that are doing more and well, it can be a vicious cycle it can be an extremely vicious cycle just trying to do just trying to be just trying to you know anyway i was still able to tidy up my wardrobe a little bit i didn't finish but um i wanted to just show you guys this is the bag <laughs> the bag i'm giving away <laughs> it's huge man the bag is even tearing of stuff there are clothes in this big giant bag okay can you guys see in this giant bag they are clothes they are shoes um there's one shoe in particular that i thought i'll show you guys <laughs> um these shoes were my wedding shoes the after party shoes was it after party and traditional wedding i bought these shoes from kod Geiger almost seven years six years ago now six years ago 2018 is when i bought them because <laughs> and yeah i've worn them a lot but not too much not as often maybe five times actually i've not worn these particular shoes i always felt like oh i'll keep it i'll keep it for my daughter or something but i mean it's 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 still in good condition but i feel like somebody else will benefit from it okay in the in the now like i can always get my girl something new something different my other wedding shoes it's only one i still have like my actual wedding day shoes every other thing i feel like they can be sentimental or not but the way this nigeria is the way the weather is things get damaged a lot let me not preserve something that they bring it out to just burst into this is a flames or whatever so i'm going to give that pair of shoes away i remember it so clearly so clear i was so happy with those shoes anyway um yeah i hope you enjoyed this vlog <laughs> i didn't do much so yeah i'm giving away dresses um this dress uh this one this dress i've worn it maybe twice i got it from chiri a bank <laughs> she did a closet seal once you guys i buy things that i like i don't care whether it's three whether it's being your wardrobe that is brand new if i like it and i think it will fit me i would buy it so i bought it we did she did a closet a closet sale um and i wore it maybe three times or so and it's, it's big for me actually so i feel like it needs a home that would appreciate it now i'm supposed to be giving this to church people one lady in the church that i give almost everything so i just like her and she's bigger than me but a lot of these clothes are bigger like when my size at one point so i like to give her stuff but i don't know how she would wear <laughs> the whole tummy is open so maybe she'll put um like a camisole or something i don't know how she'll do it but yeah this is what i'm doing i'm giving away so yeah this end of the vlog my husband is on his way back i said he traveled um he's leaving i think i don't even know if he has left yet so i'm going to go cook i want to make coconut rice for him so that will be in another vlog the start of the vlog, another vlog coconut rice with um beef okay peppered beef that's what i'm thinking i was gonna do chicken but all the chicken i have is chicken wings and my husband does not like chicken wings so i'm gonna do beef instead of chicken and i'll see you guys later i hope you enjoyed this vlog please subscribe please watch my videos you guys sometimes the views are really discouraging but I just like to encourage myself from them with this thought that 
even if like the last vlog I posted I checked and it was about 800 views right which is not good in terms of analytic standard right for your analytics it's not good in terms of that kind of standard but imagine talking to 800 people 800 people cannot fit in my house 800 people cannot even fit in my office like my actual office 800 people is a whole lot of people so when I think about it that way it kind of reorients my perspective that wow you're reaching 800 an audience of 800 people we are so spoiled because we think 1,000 subscribers, 10,000 subscribers is beans because we are seeing people with a million. But that's a lot of people, you guys. That's a lot of people. So I'm using that to encourage myself. That said, please watch my videos. Leave comments, thumbs up. It helps me. It helps the algorithm. I have some goals I would like, personal goals I would love to achieve before the end of this year. So I'm doing my best, you guys. I'm doing my best. Even my legal content. You guys say you want more of that. But then people don't watch. So it doesn't encourage. But I'm still going to keep pushing because it's not just about you guys about me as well it's about purpose it's about what i really feel good doing so i'm just gonna keep doing that and i hope you guys enjoy it and engage with it and i'll see you in my next video don't forget to give me a thumbs up <laughs> like this video subscribe and share Mwah. bye